<laughs> well guys, third time's the charm. I had tried to record this video already three times and I have failed completely. <laughs> so I'm doing this now and now I'm really gonna go rambling and going a lot faster because I already mixed up the box like incredibly so many times and I have this cold and I, from smelling this stuff I'm starting to get a headache already so I'm a mess but I was trying to film the fortune cookie soap box unboxing and I got um I, I okay let me slow down I got with this company which I bought it with my own money uh, after watching Graveyard Girl go over this same box and I, I was not even done with the video and I was already going online and getting myself into trouble so I got blessed to get the same box that she did it is the Wonderland um, soap box and it has a little sticker telling me what box it is and in the inside it has Wonderland and welcome to Fortune Cookie Soaps 2015 spring soap box and it has the name of all the stuff that is in there and it tells Wonderland the first thing I saw when I opened the box was this beautiful little butterfly which I thought it was gorgeous and I wish I had gotten two of them because like that I could have put it as earring but no so I'm gonna use it for my planner which I have a video coming up for my planner on um, what am I doing to organize myself all right and I'm gonna go down the list and this time I'm gonna be rambling really fast cuz like I said I'm getting a headache and um, my throat not getting dry so I don't know but almost Alice fortune cookie soap and it says I'd rather be almost Alice than completely Bob or Stan or for that matter and it is a fresh green snap pea and juicy pear brighten brighten this bouquet of sweet pea flowers and fresh up, sprinkled with ripe berries so I really like that scent it kind of reminds me of gardenia and it has a little fortune and it goes how long is forever sometimes just for a second and I think this would be a great model to use for my um, planner because sometimes when I'm trying to organize myself it feels like it's forever and only a second has gone by so that's that then I have twisted tea party bath tea which is this lovely little guy up in here oh I got some of the little worms like graveyard girl called them <laughs> and it is a light refreshing green tea with notes of sweet herbs vanilla bean cucumber golden amber and hints of narrowly and geranium stirred with a bright sprig of spearmint then you're supposed to run this in a half bath and so far I could smell the green tea and I can't tell you if it has anything else in there because um, it's a mild smell so I guess once I run it in with the hot water I could smell it better the next thing is who are you incense cone and it's at the little Alice in Wonderland quote is what exactly are you smoking vapor and it says a mysterious mixture of crisp bright pear twisted with tart limes vanilla orchid a dash of raw cane sugar and we all know how we do the incense cones we put fire to them <laughs> and a little incense cone right here let me you know just a little tiny one not that much and there are seven in here like I said I already tried doing this video and I failed but oh and I dropped it too seven of them all right and then it's got it's only a dream whipped cream and it says welcome to Wonderland where playing cards come comes to life and everything is full of nonsense and it is a calming barbana oh, lemongrass, calla lily, and citrus blend with leafy greens, ylang ylang, rosewood, and also with hints of soft musk and rose. And it's a nice light scent. Hold on, I'm filming. And I really like this and I can't wait to try it, especially at work because hand washing and a lot of hand sanitizer, my hands get dry so I go through lotion at work like this so tomorrow. Um, so something like that that has a nice scent 
that it's not too strong it's good for me to have around patients too and then I have off with their heads bath bomb and it says I just love my morning coffee and executions don't you <laughs> I kind of feel like Ooh, like the evil queen at that moment groves of Meyer lemons and succulent oranges mingle with a perfectly manicured garden of wild roses, violets, and star jasmine perfume with romantic tones of bergamot and Egyptian musk. And right off the bat, I smell roses. Roses and oranges. Well, I guess uh, the lemon, the lemon, Meyer my, lemons that I'm smelling, the citrusy scent. Alright, the next thing is Flutter Wacken Body Wash not here everyone's watching sun warm ladies brighten with a splash of grapefruit and a breath of fresh air and let's see what this has this has oh a nice i like that grapefruit scent it's a light scent so i'm hoping to give this a try and see how it uh, the, the scent that it leaves behind and then we have eat me perfume oil i dare you but not really your tummy will hurt you Scrumptious yellow cake with a fresh slattering of rich creamy vanilla frosting topped with fresh white pineapple slices and garnished with a sprig of blooming cilantro. And it's this little guy over here. And this is a perfume oil which, you know, a little bit goes a long way. A long time ago, I used to have that Tommy Girl. Um, oh, man. I smell off the bat. The yellow cake and... I smell what is that? It's like yeah, the this is here. The pineapple. I smell the I could smell the pineapple. I just had some pineapples and I really could smell. I could really pick up that scent. Boys, stop it. And then the last thing, I have to go fast because the boys are getting anxious now. Is that we are all mad here. O C D um hand sanitizer. And it's a which truly explains a lot. Playful mint waters and naturally leafy greens known to perform a masterful balancing act with musk, heat, rich cedar wood. And the scent is I could smell the alcohol on it and I really and that makes me feel sick. I really can't smell nothing else. My nose is getting clogged up. But I really, this is really gonna get used the heck out of because I, we use a lot of hand sanitizer at work and this is really gonna be um, something that gets used. Well, everybody, that's my soapbox and sorry I'm rambling. Is that, like I said, I already had uh, done the unboxing video five times, five, three to five times, I don't even lost count. And every time I get started or something, the kids start banging on the door or calling me or crying and I have to stop. And then one time I didn't, wasn't filming. But if you like this type of videos, please um, uh, give me a thumbs up. Please leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think about this video. I'm also going to be posting another video soon about my planner and the goodies that I've been getting for it. And I've also made an order for a new Kiki K planner, so that will be coming soon. Um, you can follow me on Instagram, Facebook, um, Twitter. <laughs> a kick anything so um i see you later and i see you in the next video bye